Periodontal disease is an inflammatory disease that um, is destructive around the teeth and gums uh, and the bone that supports the teeth. And it's a result of the bacteria or plaque that form on our teeth on a daily basis. And when we re don't, don't remove that plaque, the bacteria cause a reaction in the body which results in destruction of that attachment of the tooth to the bone and to the gum tissues. Eventually, if it goes untreated, the teeth will be lost. Gum disease is often characterized by um, initially swollen, inflamed gum tissues that bleed easily when they're brushed. Many people don't know they have it and expect that their gums bleed on occasion. The early stages of periodontal disease often go undetected and uh, at times the only sign that there's a problem might be a little blood on your toothbrush. Gum disease affects virtually everybody and it can start at a very young age. Almost, you know, most children have some early forms of gum disease that we call gingivitis and that is inflammation of the gum tissues and that can uh, just appear as, as slightly reddened gum tissues to very severely swollen and bleeding gums. Uh, unfortunately, there are some people who are at greater risk. We know that for individuals that smoke, they have a much higher incidence of, of gum disease than people who don't smoke. Um, those individuals who are afflicted by diabetes also are at an increased risk for periodontal disease. And there are certain uh, genetic components that we've found that individuals uh, share in families that make them at a higher risk for developing uh, destructive periodontal disease. If gum disease is un not treated properly, uh, the eventual um, result is loss of the teeth and it can also cause problems in the rest of the bodies. For example, um, gum disease results in inflammation, or inflammation is what really causes the destruction of the, of the bone loss and the uh, changes in the gum tissues. And this inflammation is detected throughout the body, so it can um, exacerbate conditions like diabetes. It can cause, there have been associated links with uh, cardiovascular disease, and for women who are pregnant, if they have an advanced form of gum disease, they may be at risk for having a preterm uh, low birth weight baby. For more information on periodontal disease, please visit www.perio.org.